Thousands of limestone pillars and islets sculpted by the wind and sea speckle emerald waters. This is Vietnam's Halong Bay, one of the world's most beautiful, but now a victim of its own success. At the port filled with thousands of tourists from all over the world, many say their trip is not what they had expected. It's a highway on water. We're all traveling the same boats that aren't very beautiful and emit a lot of pollution. It's a bit like Disneyland. We're all waiting in line for the same thing. Tuan Chau Port is the largest artificial tourist harbor in Asia and a major departure point for tourists visiting Halong Bay. In just three years, the number of daily visitors has doubled to 15,000, most of them from China. Water shuttle operators say it's increasingly difficult to manage soaring tourism. We don't even have enough boats for all these tourists because the numbers are constantly increasing. And during high season, we can't keep up with the demand. With more tourists comes more waste. Two nights aboard means a few meals a day per person, transforming a natural wonder into a commercial enterprise. This is what the boats leave behind in their wake, seemingly endless trails of waste. Vietnamese authorities are trying to stem the flow of pollution by hiring cleaners. But the task is gargantuan. Each day of work, a mere drop in the bucket. Only 30 cleaning boats like this one circulate the bay per year. Working here and constantly seeing more trash is discouraging. Seeing so much trash makes me sick. On days where there is less waste, I feel better. And when there's a lot of it, I work as hard as I can so that my employer is happy. Though the authorities allowed the less than flattering images to be filmed, none of them were willing to speak about the sensitive topic on camera. These local representatives said they are doing everything in their power to reduce pollution, a claim that has failed to produce noticeable results. Officials have thus far ruled out imposing quotas on the flow of tourists citing economic concerns. Halong Bay is indeed one of the most visited tourist spots in Vietnam, and now also an illustration of the dark side of mass tourism.